William. My son. How are you? I am fine, Dad. William, love you, honey. Love you, Mom. Welcome, brother. We miss you. Last two years I could not come from Dubai. My boss not allowed me to travel. How are you, brother? Hi, Danny. I am fine. How is your studies going? I am doing well, brother. What you bring for me? Don't worry. I brought something for you. Hello, brother. How are you? Fine, Diana. How is your husband, Stephen, and your kid? All of them fine. Come, let's go to home. William, how many days have you got leave? I have only got a month's leave. But, I would like to stay for two months. Because, I have been away from you all, for the past two years. That's good. Your kids will be happy. William, if you didn't go abroad, we wouldn't have lived so comfortably. In the last 10 years, we have advanced our lives, because of your hard work. Your brother Winston now completed his degree in searching for job. Your sister Diana's marriage finished, and she is having baby girl. Your youngest brother now studying degree first year. All because of you. Mom, I am happy to see them. Don't worry I will take care of them. William, myself and our two kids not seen you for the past two years, therefore, we had been very much worried. I am sorry for that. When I was away from you, those days was not happy days for me. Darling I missed you and our kids. Brother, don't forget my semester fee. How much that? It will be around 1 lakh rupees. When you need that money? Next month. Let me check. Diana, why did you call me outside? What do you want to talk to me alone? Brother, my husband likes to build house. For that, he had applied for bank loan. That's good. Boot your own house. Stephen is government employee, he can get bank loans easily. Even after the bank loan, we have 5 lakh rupees less for building house. That amount you must give me. Diana, I have borrowed a lot for your wedding. What will I do if you want more money? There are many problems I have. Daddy's medicine, mom's eye surgery, brother's education, household expenses, and my children's school admission. Please try to understand my situation. If I ask you something, you will have a lot of problems. If I had been well educated, I would not ask money from others. But, you didn't send me to college like other brothers. What will I do? Our family situation was bad at that time. Anyway don't cry, I will try to arrange money. Don't worry. Your studies are over. What you are going to do? I want to go abroad. I already talked to the travel agent, for visa and other expenses will be around 5 lakh rupees. Brother, you have to arrange that money. Already? Diana asking 5 lakh rupees for her house construction works. I don't know what to do. Her wedding cost a lot of money. Don't give her anything more. Winston, she is our sister. We must help her. Anyway I will try to arrange money. Let me take loan. Okay brother. William, I can't see anything. I have to operate my eyes quickly. Okay mom. Don't worry. William, she couldn't watch TV serials. That's why she is asking. No problem, Dad. I have some issues. After two months I can arrange money for her surgery. That's good. William, you only thinking about your family. Why don't you look after me and our children? Darling, I have a lot of problems. Please understand. I thought I might be with you and the kids for two months, but I am in a position to return in a month. William, please stay with us for two months. Please don't go. Sorry, dear. I can't stay more. I am going to book return ticket. Lift it. Okay. Place now. Not like that. Place it horizontal. Now okay. William, yesterday's productivity was very less. I am very much disappointed. Sir, I will try to improve it. Due to high temperatures outside, it's very hard to get production from workers. William, I am not here to listen your justifications. 
If you cannot get job from the labors you can resign your job and go to home. As a supervisor, it is your job to give productivity. Sorry sir, I will try to do that. Hello. Hello William, how are you? Maria, what you want? I am at work site. I would like to go to my parents house. Don't go. Don't disturb me like this. I have hundreds of problems here. I don't have time to talk. I am disconnecting your call. William, what happened? Today our engineer was shouted at me for the production. That's normal. The managers always thinks about productions and money. Afterwards my wife called me, and I couldn't talk to her very well. I was upset with engineer. Don't worry, talk to your wife. Say sorry to her. Michael, you know my problems. Two brothers, one sister, father, mother, wife and kids. I have loans also. I can't resign my job. Every day the managers and engineers are shouting at me in work site. I am really sad. What to do? My wife also not understanding my problems. Apart from my family members, my wife also giving me her time. Don't worry William, everything will be okay. God bless you. Hello. William my son, how are you? I am fine dad. Yesterday I sent 5 lakh rupees to Dania for her building construction. That's good. I know how much you struggling. Now your brother Wilson with me. He is crying since yesterday. Why? What happened? The visa agent absconded with 5 lakh rupees money, which you gave him for agent. Oh my god. Dad, what you are saying? 5 lakh rupees? I have taken loan. Ask Wilson to give police complaint. Already Wilson and myself given complaints. Police say, that agent absconded to other country and very difficult to find him. Wilson now going to private company for work. Okay, dad, I will call you later. Bye, what to do, that 5 lakh also lost. For paying that loan, I must stay here in abroad for one more year. God why you are giving me hard time like this. Hello Maria, how are you darling? I just came from work. How is our kids? William, I'm fine. Kids asking about you. When you are coming? Maria, I don't have money even for booking tickets. Every month, I must pay installment for the loan, credit cards. It will be difficult to come there. William, I don't want to live in this world. Why our life so disaster? As a woman I have some feelings. Our kids also miss you so much. Darling, please understand my situation. You must support me otherwise, I can't concentrate in my work. Please understand. Okay I will call you later bye. William, what happened? Why you are so sad? Today morning, I received call from my brother. My father admitted in hospital for heart attack. He needs surgery. William, do you want to go emergency leave? I need money for my father surgery. I must stay here, otherwise I will face problems. Okay William, if you need any help, please let me know. Hello brother, Danny speaking. Daddy's surgery over, he is okay now. William, I am okay now. Don't worry. Dad, take care. Danny stay with dad. Call me if you need anything. Okay bye. Sir, why are you so sad? My father passed away. Oh, I am sorry. Hello brother, how are you? I am fine Winston. How is married life? Convey my regards to Clara. Fine. Brother, myself and Clara planning of shifting to her house. Winston, how you can stay in Clara house? It will be not good to stay in wife house. Brother, her father was passed away. Clara lays mother alone there. Clara wants to accompany her mother. I don't have any other choice. Anyway, we are going. Bye. Winson, Winson, please don't go. Oh, he disconnected the call. William, Danny was in love with a girl from his college and she was of a different religion. He left the home for marrying that girl. William, what to do now? Your brothers forgot everything what you did for the family. Mom, what are you saying? Why he did like this? Michael, my mom on phone. 
My youngest brother Danny was in love with a girl from his college and she was of a different religion. He left the home for marrying that girl. Mom, you don't worry. Let him go. He is not my brother anymore. He should not come to our home. Bye. Michael, did you see my brothers? I struggled a lot for their life. Finally they forgot everything. William, sorry I don't have words to say. You sacrificed your life for family, but they forgot everything. What to say? Hello William, how are you? Hi Maria, I am fine. 10 lakh rupees is urgently needed to get our daughter into the college. I don't have money right now. Anyway let me check with my brothers. Wilson, how are you? I need some money urgently for my daughter college admission. Can you give me that? Sorry brother, I have plan build own house, for that I have some money, but I cannot give you that. Hello Danny, I need some money urgently for my daughter college admission can you help me? Sorry brother, I don't have money. Danny, why are you lying? We have money, don't we? Dear please understand, my brother is 60 years old, we will no longer get back the money we give him. Diana, I need some money. So long where were you? Why you didn't call me? Sorry brother, don't call me for money. I don't want any of relatives. I know only my husband and my kids. Don't call me again. William, we are going to send you to your home country. What is your plan after your retirement? Sir, I am 60 years old now. I have been working abroad for the past 35 years. For the first 20 years, I worked for my father, mother, brothers and sister. Second 15 years I worked for my children's studies, and their future. We give lights to the lives of others by melting light candle and sacrificing our lives. In the other end, everyone will forget us. This birth of ours, we live not for ourselves but for others. Because of our commitments, not only our lives our wife's life also wasted. What you said was true. Now I am 60. I have health problems like heart disease, blood pressure, diabetes. How many days I am going to live in this world is big question. This what life of non-residents who called us Pravasi.